We've got one of America's favorite foods, bacon, and it's about time that we are doing a taste test for all you bacon lovers and also for our good friend Scott Grace, who has suggested this video. We are trying four different brands, including Applegate, Jimmy Dean, Oscar Mayer, and Smithfield. We are going to be doing a tournament style taste test to find out which is the very best bacon. Also, before we jump into the taste test, be sure to subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. We upload every single Friday, and trust me, you do not want to miss one of our videos. Also, if you go on to enjoy this video, be sure to leave a like. All right, we're going to go cook up this bacon. We'll be right back. All right, let's go. All right, we're ready for our first round, and we've got the meat chips, as Colin called them, because they got a little crispy. Yeah. These are Oscar Mayer, and these are the Jimmy Dean. So should we start with the crisps? Let's do it. I know a lot of people like their bacon crispy. I kind of do, actually. I'm not a huge fan of that. I like it a little more chewy. Mm, definitely crispy. Mm -hmm. And these ones cooked the soonest, and they were the darkest. The others we had to leave um, baking. We actually did it in the oven. Mm -hmm. We had to leave these baking a little bit longer. But Maybe that means that these were the thinnest. I think so, yep. Well, tastes like bacon to me. Mm -hmm. Nothing super special. There's nothing special about that. But yeah. it's bacon meat. I think this will be an interesting taste test because I've eaten bacon, but I've never really thought about the brand at all before. I'm going to cleanse the palate before we go to the okay, Oscar you know, Mayer. I'll do I mean, too. to the Jimmy Dean. All right. Okay. Let's do it. And there's definitely a difference in size, even though they all started out about the same size. Mm. The Oscar Mayer got much, much smaller mm -hmm. than the Jimmy Dean. Wow. Taste that. Mm. Mm-hmm. That tastes better. Mm. Yes, it does. And I hope it's not just because these got more crispy. There's more meat on this one. Mm -hmm. It's thicker. It's a thicker Even slice. Even though I don't think this was a thick sliced um, piece of bacon, mm -hmm. but it just turned out thicker and it cooked better. And the taste, the taste is... Um, and the taste is definitely better. It has like a fuller taste mm -hmm. and a better taste in my yep. opinion. So I'm saying Jimmy Dean is moving on. It is. Since we're only doing four bacons today, this is actually our last matchup of the first round. Over here we have Applegate, and over here we have Smithfield. Yep. And these ones both turned out about the same, I would say, size. Mm -hmm. And they both look really good to me. Um, but the Smithfield are, is definitely a thicker cut. It was the only one that claimed to be a thick cut. Yeah. So you want to start with the Applegate? Let's do it. First, all right. Oh. Oh. Mm. Mm. Okay. That's pretty good. There's mm -hmm. a little different different tasting than the other two we just tried. Yeah. I like it. We're not comparing it to the no. one we had in the last round, but I think I do like the one we had in the last round a little bit better. This one's good. Pretty good though. I'm going to try the Smithfield now. Definitely the the thickest, like you yeah. said. Yeah. Very thick. Now you said you don't like softer bacon and this is kind of softer, which is how I like it. A little on the soft. I mean, it's definitely fully cooked. It's actually not bad. It's still a little bit chewy. It's got good flavor. These are very similar. They are very this similar. This one is thicker, which I prefer. Uh -huh. So it might win based on that, but... Hmm. As far as just the flavor goes... Oh, you know what? I think I do actually like this better. There's some smokiness to it. I don't really taste the smokiness, but... You think you like this one better? No, not necessarily. I would just say that they're very similar. Um, but I might slightly favor the Smithfield okay. over the Applegate. So Smithfield going to the final? Yeah, so Smithfield right. versus Jimmy Dean. So for our final round, we have Jimmy Dean and Smithfield. And this is the thin sliced and this is the thick sliced. Yes. So let's go back to the Jimmy Dean. I'll try not to let that um, affect it too much. I'm going based off of taste here. Because yeah. you can probably get a thicker one and a thinner one from each brand. Mostly flavor is what we're going for. Mm-hmm. It's a good flavor it's over good. on this side. Yeah, it's good. It's um, maybe a little more subtle than was, over here. I was going to say, it's kind of plain. But, yeah, but I do like the flavor that it has. Yeah, it's good. And I don't really know how to describe it besides just pig meat. Yeah, tastes like salty mm -hmm. bacon. Oh, wow. Yeah, this one's just a lot more thick. <laughs> All right. All right, Going let's get for a the Smithfield. piece of that. Okay. So... The flavor comes through a lot more on this one, but is it a better flavor? Well, I don't know. I think I like this one a little bit better, but this one actually seems like it has more meat on it. Mm. Um, it's possible that that's just based on the cut that we got, um, but you can taste a little bit more meat in this one, I think, than this one. This one's yeah. got quite a lot of fat in it, which, you know, has plenty of flavor itself. That's a good point, actually, yeah. This one is like <clears throat> half 
fat almost. And this one is all meat. And I would say, you know, in bacon, you do tend to get a lot of fat, so that's not too surprising. Yeah. But uh, I like tasting the meat better than I like tasting the fat. <laughs> well. They're both really good. Yeah, they are. And I'm trying to take out the fact that this one is a lot thicker because I definitely prefer that. Mm -hmm. And when I do that, I think that this one is actually better. You know, I'm going to have to agree with you. All I right. actually think I like the Jimmy Dean a little bit better in flavor than mm -hmm. I do the Smithfield. Yeah. I'm kind of surprised about that. but And I think if we got this Jimmy Dean in, with a thicker cut, it would have been be like by far the best. Super tasty. Kind of like when we did our hamburger video, mm. the um, in and out in and out versus the, uh, what is it, Five Guys? Yeah. And we needed a thicker burger to I fully know. compare properly between the two. Um, go ahead and check that video out if you haven't seen that. But yeah, I think I'm going to have to go with the thinner Jimmy right. Dean so, for the win. Yeah, winner of Best Bacon. Now, we didn't try all the brands, but we looked up on websites what were some of the best highly rated brands, and this is all we could find in stores. We went to, what, four different stores? Yeah, four different stores, and each one had one of the different ones that we were looking for. Mm -hmm. Now, probably in your local grocery, you're going to find a bunch of more local farms that um, sell bacon. Yeah. Um, but since we can't go all over the country and look for all those different bacons, yeah. we chose the ones that were most popular and that you'll probably be able to find at most grocery stores. So there you go. Jimmy, Jimmy Dean, Dean, best bacon. Win. This is going to be the end of the video. We hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, be sure to leave a like and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. We'll see you next week. See ya. All right, well, there's my sodium and fat for the day. Yeah.